welcome back to part 7 of 7 Days to Die. I'm Crazy Vazy. It's nice to see you're interested in the channel. So then, the last time you've seen this, I was fortifying my base, putting a wall around it to stop the zombies breaking in. Well, I need a workbench, so I thought, where best to get it than Deersville? So I'll head out. Mind you, there's a few dogs, so I'm going to show you how to take care of them. Wait, how I take care of them. Oh, I missed him there, that's no good. But I can hear a dog coming. Right, put myself a couple of crates down. Don't worry, don't panic at this stage. There we go. This is how I take care of the dogs. A couple of crates down. And then get my arrows out. I haven't got many. And it's trying to get your shots on target. Uh, and I'm keeping missing. That's terrible. I'll stick my night vision on. That always helps us get a better shot with the contrast. I was looking for a minus helmet, but wait, hey, what do you know? I found a night vision camera, so that'll have to do for now. Alright then, let's have a look. There's some more zombies coming. Zombie nurse, oh dear. 39 arrows left, that's not good, that's not good. I do have a blunderbuss, but I don't want to use it yet. Come on. There you go, there's one shot, there's one shot. Champion. Come on, doggy. There you go. That's how you take care of the dogs. Easy as that. Just make sure you've got plenty of arrows on you. <laughs> The last thing you want to be doing is going against them with no arrows from a distance. And you don't want to be getting up close to them. If they make you bleed, you could die really quick. So, I'll take care of this zombie. And I think I'm going to make my way along to the hospital. That's the goal. I need some mechanical parts. I'm going to loot the trolleys with me wrench. So, let's have a look. Down we go, I think. Mind you, I prefer Deersville to Gravestown, out of both towns. And there you go, say. I'm at a trolley. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to loot these trolleys, and I'm going to go loot the hospital. It'll take us a while to loot the hospital, because as I say, I need mechanical parts and whatever else I can pick up. So I'm going to skip through the looting. Um, yeah, I want to make these episodes as interesting as possible, and it's a bit of a grind this game, you've heard us say it before, and I really want to get back to base, so while I'll do all the boring stuff, I'll skip through most of it so you can get the good stuff. There's another trolley over there, let's go get a mechanical part off that. There we go. And you see my wrench is pretty low. I need to get a better wrench, and to do that, if I don't find one, I'll have to make a workbench. And that'll help us build me mini bike anyway when I find the book. That's the plan. Be doggy. Get some parts. Right, so I've just looted the hospital. Um, Got to head back home now. So then, here we go. Alright, drink some grain alcohol, because I can't be bothered with the dogs, I've got no more arrows left. Just me blunderbuss with some ammo, but I want to keep a hold of that for dog day, which is day 10. Right, night vision camera. Uh, I'll leave it on for a little bit, and I'll take it off. Right, head back to me base. Okie dokie, and when I get back to base, I'll show you what I've been working on. Oh, turn my night vision off now, I think. Yeah, looks bright enough. Plenty of houses here. And no, I haven't looted them all yet, just a couple. Okay, I'll quickly run back as fast as I can. I've already took care of most of the dogs around here, I just, I didn't want to be taken on anymore. I've, run, I've only got one jar of honey left and I might need it. Alright then, so I'll show you back at base. And here we are. I've made the workbench, as you can see. There's my forge. I've even put a couple of lights on the ceiling. Yeah. I just smelted some televisions and got all the parts I needed for them. Right then. So that's my room I'm expanding downstairs. Um, I've put some business glass on the roof here. So it's a bit like open air, really. Okie dokie. Right, this little section here. It's got coffee beans and everything in. Some blueberries. 
the big wall going all the way around. It's made with cobblestone, fortified with clay. Uh, my farm's doing pretty well. I did have a pet pig in here. <laughs> it was stuck in the water there. Anyway, let's show you what it looks like. Right, you can see my wall going all the way around. What I'm going to do is dig outside around it, fortify it with some spikes. Um, put a, a gantry and a walkway along the top with some iron bars. At least that way I can uh, defend it from zombies that come towards us on Horde Night. So let's have a look at it from a distance, eh? And this is just me quick build. Yeah. Please like and subscribe and I'll give you some more content. Thank you.